again, a student asked me about this effect here, which has this really cool curved wipe that goes across the whole page. Now it happened really quick, so when I went to inspect it, all I could see was that there were two SVGs involved. That didn't help too much, so I went ahead and I recorded this little video here so that I could at least watch the effect in slow motion, okay? Ooh, I like to scrub slowly, and here you'll see we start with a very flat curve. It gets much more rounded towards the top, and then it flattens out. And as soon as the screen is filled with that sort of full orange, you'll notice the next curve comes in, okay? Ooh, very nice. So it's sort of what I call this double curve wipe, all right? Very nice and springy. Well, after a little bit of fiddling around, I came up with this version here. You like that? I use some different colors. And basically, I'm using Green Sox Morph SVG to morph one shape into two shapes, all right? We start with our starting shape, and we go up to a curved shape somewhere around here, and then it goes to another state that's flattened out. If you look above here, you'll see this is the artwork that I'm using. I have a start, middle, and end shape. And then in the code, I just tell the start shape to morph into the middle shape and then into the end shape. And again, we get this nice, dreamy, silky smooth animation. Hope you like this little tip, and I'd love to see how you would build something like this. If you want to learn everything I know about GSAP, I'll show you all my tips and tricks in my comprehensive GSAP bundle. Sail in soon. See you in creativecodingclub.com.